What is up, my Moon Tribe? I'm Haley, and welcome back to Moon Tribe Tarot. This is going to be for the star sign of Virgo for January 1st to the 10th of, Jan of January 2021. Take what resonates and leave behind what does not. If you'd like to book a personal reading with me, where your messages will 100% correlate to your story, because they're specifically for you in mind, you can find all the information how to reach me for a reading in the description box down below. If you like the content that I make, please like and subscribe. It would mean the world to me. Uh, without any further ado, I've already gone ahead and pulled your card off camera like always for you Virgo so let's get right into the reading okay so we got the ace of oops we got the ace of oops the ace of cups we got the eight of wands we got the knight of swords outcome I asked um, where the knight of swords was going to be taking this and it was the eight of pentacles this is a gorgeous spread Virgo okay so right off the bat we have the ace of cups it represents a new beginning of love either that you give yourself somebody gives you it can be a renewal an apology it is a chalice of healing emotion and love it is a new beginning of an emotional direction and it represents with the eight of wands coming in with it that this is happening quickly now this could be coming in from somebody else doing this to you but the energy could be reversed um, where you're doing this to this person. I'm not looking at this. I think it could potentially be you, but I don't re I don't read um, the star signs. So this is a, a Gemini Libra Aquarius, but it could be you doing this. This could still show up for a Virgo. I don't read the star signs. I read the energy. Um, so it could be a female or a male in this situation too. It's a gender bender deck as well. So when I read this, I, I'm pretty... It, it doesn't really matter. Somebody is giving emotion. It's going to be um, brought up or given very, very soon. It represents that this is going to have kind of a quick reaction type of thing. Um, I'm almost, I heard, I just heard the phrase flight or fight response. So, okay. I'm pretty sure that this is going to be an apology, either that you are giving somebody an apology or somebody is giving an apology to you. Um, it will be communicated quickly and there will be a very, um, there will be a quick choice to be made in this situation. The Knight of Swords is somebody that comes in and out of a situation very quickly. It represents that he is, he, he, he can be problematic, a page of, um, he can travel t between the page of swords to the, the king of swords which is like a big fucking gallop um, but he has the ability to transcend that and do that uh, I feel like he's the only one that has the ability to do that in the tarot um, but he has that ability um, so it represents I, I have a very solid idea that this is an apology coming in in some vein and deciding if you it's either an apology or a new sense of beginning uh, so in either in either way I feel like this comes up very quickly, and I think you get a very quick response as to what direction this goes in. Because, the knight, again, the Knight of Swords is either coming in or he's coming out. And in this sense, he is definitely coming in and staying around to put work into the situation. Specifically because it's emotion and it came out with another person involved. This is going to be working with you or you working with them. The Eight of Pentacles is an apprentice card. It represents going back to work on something very hard for a trade. So school, going back to work on a relationship type of thing. This is going back to work on something. It's an apprenticeship. It's being very studious about this and making sure that all your decks are in a row. So I get really good energy with this, actually, because I get the sense that you have an apology. You, you, I'm getting the feeling that you are a little bit anxious. If this is you giving out the energy of the apology, you're like, oh, God, he, he, he's going to dismiss me. He's not going to want to work on this again uh, or for this friendship, for this relationship. And it's going to be like, no, let's work on it. And it's kind of a very, it might be unexpected uh, because the Eight of Wands is also... These are the two fastest cards in the deck. I didn't realize this, that they were together. Um, this is a very, very fast moving card uh, spread. So we have a new emotion given, and then it's like, wee! let's put all the work into it. It's very, very fast. It's going to be very rapid. Um, you might be a little bit surprised of how chaotically fast this is, um, but it does end in a good direction. This He's taking this in a good direction, the King of Swords definitely does want to put the work into the situation and acknowledge that emotion, that apology. I definitely feel I'm hearing pull another card. And this is either where I shoot myself in the foot or I get super solid validation. Let's find out what it is. What do you want me to know, spirit? This goes upright because everything else was reversed. 
uh, as well. So this is super validation. This is something that you've been working for. This is, it represents, it's less so something that you're working for. And this is more so advice that spirit wants you to directly know. This is a good start. This is a triumphant good start. But you can't stop putting the work in. Uh, you don't just drive halfway to your destination and then get every car and be like, I want, I'll get to this at a later point. No, you fucking keep going. You keep going. Keep putting the work into this solidly. This is a re there's a reason this card came up for you specifically, Virgo. I think that for some of you, I um, might have a hard time finishing what you start. Um, th th I don't 100% know that, but uh, that's the feeling that I get off these cards. But it it's it's saying this is a good progress. This is really good. You've done a really good job. Keep going. This is not the finish line. You have a lot of work to do. As long as you want to put into the work in this situation, you're going to make out like a king. This is insanely good energy for you, Virgo. I'm super excited for this for you. I love the shit out of you, and I will see you on the flip side. Peace out.